this is how the heater core is supposed to work. Hot water from the engine or coolant comes into here and then it goes through this top part of the tank. So this is in green here is the heater core itself. It's basically a mini radiator. So the hot water comes into the top and then what it's meant to do is flow down through it and then back out. So it circulates through. So the problem is, on a lot of these cars, these get clogged up. Over time what happens is they collect just sediment and corrosion and basically just gunk from the cooling system. And it starts to kind of collect in the top here and it'll start to sit and it'll block this passage here as the water kind of flows, it wants to push everything that way. And what'll happen then is then this passage doesn't get hot. And then over time, sort of one by one, these start to clog up. And there's still flow through it and you still get heat in the vehicle, but the issue is we drew down here kind of the blend doors that send the heat into the cabin. And what will happen is there's a, a split in here to go for, it depends on the layout, but for example, the driver's side and the passenger side. And as these get clogged up, you get to a point where this side of the heater core is not getting hot. You're still getting flow through this side, you still get plenty of heat out of the one side, but on the other side, you're just getting now cold air coming out of here. So what we did to diagnose it is we cut the heater core in half this way, sort of looked inside of it. Couldn't see too much in there. Then we split it down the middle and we also cut open the top of the tank so we could see inside of there. So there's, so we cut it in half and then we cut it into quarters. So you can see where that would have been basically the top of it. This end here is where the water was coming in. And when you look down inside of it, you can see all of the crap in there just blocking up all of the channels in it. If you look on the other side, there's some on this side, but not nearly as much, where it was actually getting some flow through it still. Actually, we've got this. This is what came out of it. And it's just incredible amount of gross stuff in there. We even found like part of a gasket. It's like maybe part of a water pump gasket or something from a previous service. But you can see just this whole pile of stuff was in there clogging it up.